Hey! Hey! Hey, wake your ass up! <laughs> wake your ass up, boy! Look, 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 look. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wake your ass up, man. <laughs> this boy, boy, look. YouTube, what is going on? Chasing Mr. Hamilton is the name. Trucking is the game. Wallet to get swollen is the goal. The heart of a lion mentality for hyena. We steady rolling wide because we don't get tired. We get money. Oh, mama. There goes that man. Now, you're probably wondering, man. Yeah, yeah. Look. Bro, why did I make such freaking pretty babies, bro? Bro, my pride and joys right there, man. My freaking pride and joys, y'all. My pride and joy, my son, man. That's, that's what I'm doing all this for, y'all. What I'm doing all this for. Guess what time it is, though? <laughs> guess what time it is? Hold up. Hold up. You ain't got to guess. I'm going to show you. Let me show you, damn it. All right, look, look. First thing first, right? This thing finally came in, y'all. I had to freaking wait out here, man. Finally, we finally got them recaps hours back. Golly, man. You see, I'll be honest with y'all. Whenever, sometimes these uh, little things, I just, I BS my way through it, whatever. I literally just type whatever. I do not care. Trailer, don't care. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, anyway, because I'm trying to show y'all something they know. All right, man, recaps finally came in. Remember, I had 17 minutes, y'all. My eight hours finally came in. Can y'all see that, right? Yeah, them eight hours finally came in, y'all. So we ready to roll. With that being said, guess what time it is right now? <laughs> it is 12 o'clock, you two. It's freaking 12 o'clock. Now let me share, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Let, let, let me get in the light. Cause yeah, let me take all this hat. Cause you ain't gonna be able to see a, a, a real dark skin. I know freaking 12 o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, man. Before we even start this video off the bat. Since I got back on the road, bro. I've been sleeping like maybe four or five hours out of my 10 hour break. I'm gonna tell y'all why. Like, I am a, a protege of Warren Buffett, right? I'm a protege of Buffett. I don't mean like the man is out here training me or nothing, but I look, I look up to Warren Buffett. That man reads six hours a day of investment papers and news. Six hours a day. The more I got to look into it, I noticed that rich people, I ain't talking about your rappers or athletes or whatever. I'm talking about rich people, bro, do not sleep eight hours a day. Because if you think about it, that is a quarter, right? That's a quarter of your life. There is 20, there's 48 hours in a day. If you're sleeping eight, that's about 33% right there of your life, man. So I start, I start, dude, since I got on the road, I'm not making this up. The most I've slept is like maybe five hours. Today I slept too, because I'll be BSing, but I'll be also be doing a lot of research while I'm out here. Y'all check it. L -l 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 Let me show you what, what I do. What I be doing? Notes, y'all. These ain't nothing but notes. These ain't nothing but notes, y'all. That's what this is. This is notes. I'm trying to work on my credit, man. So I'm trying to f I'm, look. I'm literally looking up every source I can get access to. I'm looking at uh, um, freaking primary lines. I'm looking at if I need a uh, if I need a company to help me repair my sh right cuz I'm at 660 right now that ain't good enough for the kid y'all that might be good for y'all it might be good for you but it ain't good for me you know what I'm saying so I be doing I do a lot of thinking I do a lot of thinking while I'm out here man future business plan what I need to do when I get back to Houston what what I want 2021 to be like that's what I be doing at night so I don't be sleeping bro I don't be sleeping that much and I feel fine honestly after 3 4 hours closing my eyes I'm good I'm literally good. I'm not, I be good. I don't be driving sluggish or nothing. I be good. So wake your ass up, boy. Wake your ass up. So guess what we're about to do, though? Guess what we're about to do? Guess what? Now that we finally got these freaking recaps. Guess what we're about to do? Yeah, we're about to go outside. 
do a really quick pit trip right now because it's 41 degrees outside it ain't too bad it's freaking 12 o'clock yeah man don't believe me yeah yeah probably don't believe don't believe the kid let me show y'all let me show you look look yes sir that's what time it is in the morning so uh yeah i'm about to go out there and just a regular pre-trip y'all regular lazy ass pre-trip i'll be right back to do some light check y'all everything good should look good I'm gonna go out let me turn on my four-way y'all about to turn on this four-way there you go let's go quick trip quick trip around the block man I hope what I told y'all makes sense man it just it's something I'm beginning to understand something i'm beginning to learn and these are truths man it's truths rich people don't sleep eight hours a day man they don't sleep eight hours a day because if you think about it, there's so much you can do in eight hours all your body needs to reset is about four or five hours maybe six that's it so i'm i'm, I'm spending the rest of my time just doing things on myself like researching credit mainly credit right now i ain't gonna lie to you look the lights are good the lines are solid ain't nobody mess with my camping Let's go. Let's freaking go. So since we're all out of TA, and that's why we get most of our fuel discount. By the way, y'all notice where my idle RPM is? I, I'm gonna make a video about that separately one day, okay? Make a video about that separately one day. But uh, yeah, like for me, man, for me, what I'm doing right now is I really don't see myself sleeping a full 10 hours anymore, man. I don't. So eventually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I, I, I'm gonna pick up like a other form of hobbies or making money, whether it be investment, stuff like that, and, and, and just invest, do, do, make some investments, move while I'm in the truck in my, in my 10 hour break. That's eventually what I'm gonna start doing. At least that's the plan, but you know, I gotta, I got other things I gotta handle first, you know? Whenever I get back to Houston, and when I go to Houston, it's gonna be just for a few days, maybe for like a 34, cause Lord know my black ass need that right now, man, cause I'm running on recaps, man. And this recap, I feel like took for freaking ever to come in, bro. Good Lord Almighty. But it's finally here, so that's good. Uh, I'm 300 and something miles away to where this load need to be at. But since we're out of TA, I'm gonna go ahead and get me like 30 gallons. And I'm going to Florida, so Florida usually ain't exactly the best spot for cheap gas. So I'm gonna put in like 30 gallons of fuel. And then I'm gonna go from there, bro. I'm gonna go from there. And also the beautiful, I don't want to say beautiful, but the good thing about uh, me leaving right now at 12 a.m. is I'm hoping that will allow me to skip some of this ungodly traffic that's usually existing in Orlando. You know what I'm saying? If any of y'all ever been to Orlando, Florida, you, you know what I'm talking about. So that's definitely going to be a plus. Slide through, get to the delivery, drop this bad boy off. 
And call it a freaking day, man. Call it a freaking day. I might, I might get a little bit of death too. Looks like while I'm here, I wasn't gonna get any, but I might get some right now. There you go. Yeah, I'm gonna have to turn you off, Genesis. My bad, babe. My bad, boo. I'm gonna have to turn you off real quick. Oh, man, glasses falling and everything, man. But, uh, and sometimes I advise you to do that, man. Run at night. Run at night ain't bad at all, bro. It's not bad. It's not bad. It allows you to skip a lot of things. Now, in the winter, sometimes it's not the smartest move. But come on, man. I'm, I'm going to Florida. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to Florida. Like, what's the... You know what I'm saying? Like, what's the worst thing that can happen in Florida? It's, it's not that cold. It's a little chilly, like I said, 41 degrees. But it's not that cold. You know what I'm saying? It's not that cold at all. We're gonna get some gas, y'all. Some diesel. I hit y'all in a second. Man, I'm gonna tell you something, man. Y'all really want to know what's killing us is this damn death price, bro. Death is ridiculous. There we go. We solid, you two. <laughs> yes, sir. We are solid, you two. Man, we are solid. Guess what's about to happen, y'all? Guess what we're about to do, y'all? Wait a minute. Hold on. Guess what we're about to do? Yes, sir. On the road again. I can't wait to be on the road again. I'm making music with all my friends. I can't wait to be on the road again. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So we're going to roll out. Let's get this uh, by the bing. By the boom. Let me make sure my GPS, man, this thing frustrated it taught the ridiculousness out of me, bro. I'm not even gonna lie to nobody, man. I got mad as hell. Mad as hell waiting for this freaking, waiting for this uh, recap hours to come in, man. All right, so 321 miles is what we got to go before we reach Orlando. So. I think the move is I'm gonna stay on 10 till I get to 75, then I'm gonna go south. That's the move. Let's go. Damn, boy. I'm out here. I'm out here going backwards and stuff. That's the move, y'all. What's really killing us guys? I think I already said it. Man, hold on. What the heck? What the heck, folks? Can I put on my freaking seatbelt? Is that, is that cool with you? Thank you. Thank you so much. Sheesh. Sit back, got stuck. But what's killing us is that death, y'all. And I, I'm not even talking about, oh, yeah, messing up the equipment engine. No, I'm talking about the freaking price. I'm worried about the money. That freaking price is killing us, bro. That price freaking got 10 gallons for $30. That's freaking $3 a gallon. Which ain't bad at this spot, by the way. That's why I went ahead and got it, because other places, you're damn near looking at $4 a gallon, so. It's killing us. Let's roll, let's roll. Like I said, guys, it's 12 a.m. right now. Yo, 
y'all get to hear a little bit of this jet brick that Genesis 6 got, okay? Because some of y'all think only manuals can purr. I don't think so, man. My girl can purr now. My girl can purr, okay? Usually when I'm rolling, I don't really turn on any music until like the first, after the first four or five hours. I just sit and think, man. That's how I usually be. I sit and think. And then once, like once I start rolling, once everything start falling in place, then that's why I usually would turn on the music. We are 40 degrees right now, y'all. I will also tell you all, uh, one thing that sometimes prevent me from riding at night is I don't have a deer guard. I'll be honest with y'all, I have no freaking deer guard, man. So I feel like every time I ride at night, I'm rolling the dice or hitting the freaking deer and destroying my equipment. Which is why it's very important for you to get physical damage coverage on your truck, y'all. Because it will happen. But you know, over here in Florida is not so notorious for having deer on the side of the road and stuff. So that's a plus. Once I go down a little bit, I'm gonna turn on the beam. But right now I'm doing just fine without it. So right now we are 75, that's usually my cruising speed. Yes, I've had a lot of people tell me, oh, well, you must enjoy going there and throwing your money out the window. No, man. I enjoy freaking going from point A to point B quick and getting it over with, on to the next money. I, I, like, I don't see any reason why I need to be doing 70 when the speed limit is 75. You know what I'm saying? I know this is a sweet spot, don't get me wrong. But right now, I just, eh. Not just right now, I usually just don't care, man, to be honest. I just wanna go point A, point B, get it over with, and hop on the next money load, that's it. That's literally all I care about sometimes. So we're looking at, at 321 miles when I left, so that's gonna probably gonna take me roughly five and a half hours. All right, there goes a deer right there, damn it. Never mind, I lied, y'all. I just passed a deer right there on the side of the road. Ah, oh, man. I ain't gonna, it's an uneasy feeling, man. Like whenever you see deers out here, just, you know, I'm gonna have to turn on the beam now. Cause I want to make sure I can see them ahead of time. I can see them on the road. But yeah, those those be stupid, man. I mean, I guess freaking box are smarter than those. I don't know. But usually most of the deals I see on the side of the road are those. Like, get your ass back in the woods, man. It's freaking cold. Go to sleep. Do something. Like, damn. In all of 
my four years of trucking, I've been blessed not to, re I've never really ran over an animal. You know what I'm saying? I've gotten close now, don't get me wrong. I've hit two birds and hundreds of butterflies, but you know, I've never killed like a raccoon or a fox or a deer or a cow, none of that. So I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful, man, because I'm not a tree hugger, but I think it will kind of, it would tug on my heart a little bit if I was to end the life of an animal with a truck. Because that's a tough way to go, man. Let me see if I can give you a little bit of this Jake break right here everybody be talking about. Hold on, man. Hold on. I don't know it's probably not gonna be too damn good right now because I'm not going downhill or nothing something coming like a downgrade or something right we're about to hit it we're about to see what's going on over here yeah a little bit now if it was heavy man it's a lot bad than that man that thing's a badass in my opinion i feel like if this was like a, a 13 speed with the with, with man my jake be sounding beautiful bro you guys should hear that if I'm like 40 pounds, I mean 40,000 pounds, going down like a, a seven, uh, seven or five downgrade, man, I'm like, oh, you know, like, it, it be sexy, man. It be sexy. I got the Cummins ISX, but I got a big block. Instead of just a basic ISX, you can find it like an international Freightliner. So, yeah, man, it be sounding sexy. Be sounding sexy, man. Alright y'all, I think this video is probably long enough for right now, so y'all get the jest, man. We riding. We riding 12 a.m. right now. I'm hoping to be at the destination at 6. I keep y'all posted, you too. I will keep y'all posted, man. As you can see, seems to me like the rest of the world is finally waking up. And uh, yes, sir. So we had to make a peace stop, y'all. Peace stop. So we're gonna go pee real quick, damn it. Then after that, we're rolling back out. We still got, shoot, we only got 71 miles to go. It ain't too bad, y'all. It ain't too bad. I know you're still asleep now. Don't act like I don't know you're still asleep. <laughs> 
boy, I know you're still asleep, but hey, you know, you know how it is, man. I rather, I rather tell you than to, I rather show you than to tell you, man. That's just, that's why I'm letting you in the loop. That's all. I ain't expecting you to, to be up right now. You know what I'm saying? We got 78 miles to go, man. You can do a hell of a whole lot of damage in a short time, averaging while you're cruising at 70, 75 miles an hour, y'all. Uh, that, that's, that's lessons long. Just remember that. You can do a whole lot of damage. So I'm to make sure we're in deck because we're about to go in here real quick. Here we go. Yes, sir. Uh, oh, man. Woo! Yes, sir. Mass required. I don't know how they, 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 they let me in here in most of these, man. Because. Because that is definitely one thing I never do, y'all. Definitely one thing I never do. I think the sign said right here. Yeah, here we go. Like a, yeah, hold on. Yes, sir. Oh, back at it, man. Back out it. Tell y'all all we were doing. Oh, this is wrong, wrong, wrong side. Tell y'all what we were doing, man. We're just coming in here. Good morning. We were just coming in here, you know. On letting these pipes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> We're going back, y'all. That was it, baby. That was it. We got 71 miles, man. Hey, what time is it right now? It is 5:20. So, yes, sir. So we 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 did some miles now. Good morning, man. How you doing? You getting some money? You getting some money? Man, at least you off early, early and getting it. That's the way to do it, man. Yeah. Man. Hey, have a nice day. You too, ma'am. You too. Man, early birds, y'all. <laughs> Some of us trying to get it, baby. Some of us trying to get it. Now, I know some of y'all ain't trying to get it now. I know some of y'all ain't trying to get it. <laughs> but we ain't trying to get it, boy. We trying to get it, y'all. Look, that's just how it is, baby. That's look. I don't hate you. If you ain't out here early like me, trying to get it before the rest of the world wake up, I don't hate you, bro. I still got the same love for you, man. Still got the same love. So don't think, don't think I hate you, cause I don't. I still got the same love for you, man. It's just who. You gotta get it how you live, bro. You gotta get it how you live. I'm trying to find out which, where, where the heck is the exit at? See, this is what I be talking about, man. I ain't got time. I can't even read the damn sign because somebody's parked right there. So, yeah, we're busting the damn U turn right now. That man don't even look trustworthy to me. You damn you turn right now, bro. Let's go. We're trying to get it how I live, boy. So 71 miles to go, like I said, to Orlando. And then after that, man. <laughs> after that, I'm either gonna find a love or TA. I'ma prefer to find a TA, man. Cause it's time for all change. And possibly time to do a reset, man, because I'm thinking it will, it will be time for a reset because I need a reset now. Don't get me wrong now. I need a reset. But shoot, I don't really want to see it in Florida for too long. So if uh, so I might just decide to screw that and, and get me like a short, like a short run loads. 
you know, like uh, like the loads going short distances and, and work on those until I'm more positioned in a better place to do a reset. You know what I'm saying? These are all possibilities, man. It's all possibilities. Ain't, ain't, ain't no nothing decisive. We're just looking at all possibilities. Let's go. How you doing, you too? How you doing? How you doing, y'all? We're back at it again. See, that's where I almost turned right there. Heck no, I'm glad I didn't. Because I don't even know where that road ends up, to be honest. Yes, sir. The rest of the world is waking up. Everybody else trying to get it. <laughs> they're trying to get it. They're out here running like, like they're really up to something. You know what I'm saying? Like they're really trying to be the early bird out here. Hey, man, boy, if y'all don't sit down, the real early birds being already eaten. I don't, I don't got most of the worms already. So this is the this guy's right here just gonna get the little bitty worms that I left I left for y'all man. I left for y'all done did man bro I done did over 300 miles already man in five hours. Come on man. We we started with like with 300 and no 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 I did about 250 already in let's see there's, there's four hours so yeah like like 250 260 miles in four hours because i started with eight hours i got four hours and 17 minutes left as of right now it is what it is boy it's how to get it how we live get it how we live Appreciate this ride along, fam. <laughs> I appreciate you coming and riding with me, y'all. Uh, me and Genesis, man. Genesis doing her thing. We pulling. We pulling. We rolling, man. Steady. Steady rolling. So she doing her thing. She holding up, man. Ever since the big, like the middle of the year, once I dropped out bands, we got our top engine adjustment change all the sensors like the knock sensors and things like that bro she been solid man she been good genesis ain't really give me no problem like recently at all so i'm happy for that shoot baby girl be doing her thing man which is good because i think when i do all change i'm gonna get me extra belt on i'm gonna replace these ones and um and get a uh, replace this one and hold on to the old one on spares, man. You know, just a preventative measure. Cause this, the, the ones in here is probably like a little bit over a year, a year old or less than that actually. Sure, I probably got that stuff in like April or March of 2019. You know what I'm saying? Okay, yeah, they're definitely over a year old then. No, that's a lie, cause I didn't even start until August. So, yeah, so March of 2020, March of 2020, my bad. So they're less than a year old, you know? So I may have to replace them, I'm not sure. But I'm definitely gonna check them though. If I see any signs of crack, tear, or dry rot, you know, like, dehydration or whatever on the belt then that's probably what I'm gonna do is uh I'm gonna go ahead and change them but when I go for this oil change I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell them to check my uh, radiator fluid as well because I still think that might be the one leaking it just it leaks weird man like 
really weird times. I don't think it leaks while I'm rolling. It leaks whenever I stop and turn the car and turn the truck off. That's when this stuff usually leaks. So I don't know, man. All right, y'all. All right, all right. So we're gonna, we're gonna. It looks like we are here, y'all. I don't even know if I came through the right entrance now, but it looks like we're here. Gugu was trying to take me somewhere else, freaking for once. The damn Qualcomm kind of saved my life, but not really. I, I think I came in the wrong way, y'all. But we'll see what's up. Well, yeah, we're definitely out here. <laughs> we're definitely out here, you too. Damn it, boy. Damn it, boy, we're out here. We let's get this paperwork. Yes, sir. I'm pretty sure they're gonna probably need my ID and all that nonsense. So step outside and go handle some business. Ugh. Ugh. How you doing today, ma'am? Good morning. Good morning, huh? Good morning. I got a delivery for y'all. It's a drop, so. Oh, medical equipment? Yeah, something like that. It's a little warm over here, man. Over here? <laughs> yeah. It's not the nah, I'm playing. It's cold as hell out it's here. Cold. It's cold out here, man. It's cold. Oh, yeah, okay. You got you got a little toasty in there. Got a little heat, got a little heat on. Uh, okay, I got you. Yeah, I'm all right. Um, what's your name? Uh, it's Enoch. E Here, actually, let me give you my uh, license. Well, I just need Enoch. I need the Yeah, I know, but, you know, I don't want ladies out here chasing me, you know. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. It is four two six five six six. You got coffee yet since it's coughing season or no? Coffee? I said you got coughed yet since it's coughing season? Oh. Yeah, I'm always cuffed. Oh, oh, okay. Always cuffed. Always cuffed. Always okay. <laughs> I got you. Man, that's 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 some confidence right there. It is what it is. Take your time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm definitely not doing that.
Uh, we'll pop the sale off of that. I got you. So, want me to pull forward or? Yeah, you can. Oh, uh, no. Stay, okay, I got you. I got you. Oh, all that work. Oh, 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 thank you. Thank you. I've been all right. I mean, I, I had to start rolling at 12 because I was in like, I was in, um, sure, I think like 60 miles from Tallahassee. So I knew I had to be over here and drop this. The, the load came from, uh, anyways, it came from Super Fall. Like, it, like, like Mexico or something? Nah, nah, it's actually farther than that. If you think about it, cause it's a 2,500 mile load. Mexico ain't that far from here. Uh, you guys got some empties, right? Yeah. All right, good. I don't know for sure, but I think they do. Okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> I didn't know I was supposed to come. My bad. Yeah, you have to break this shield and show me what's back here. Oh, you have a big lot. Yeah, I got, I got, I got my. Oh, do I got to remove that? I got the keys in the truck. I can oh, go. You do, but oh shit, yeah, you do. Yeah, okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah, we run in the day, you too. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. We running, damn it. We are running. This key better be okay. There you go, man. I'm like, boy, you better be. While we do that, I'm gonna get him out of here, okay? Okay, I got you, I got you. Whew! Oh, uh, yeah, y'all yeah, didn't know the boy is a, a freaking cheater on two legs, did you? Yes, sir. Hussein Bolt ain't got nothing on me, damn it. Comes to this money, we're running. All right, so she said that, and then break the seal. Oh! and then open up. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm, I'm guessing, I'm guessing that that's what she wanna do. So we just, baby girl, come on, love. Oh, come on. So not medical equipment back here. I didn't even know, damn it. All right. There we go. Thank you. And here's the seal. You need this? Yes, I do. Thank you so much. No problem, ma'am. No problem. All right, so now whenever, obviously, you're going to tell me where I'm dropping this stuff, right? Um, yes. So this is going to be anywhere from 28 to 57. You can just find a load. Once you come in, you're just going to go straight like towards the right and it'll okay. show you okay so uh, any door from 28 to 57 okay, okay. so 28 to 57, 57. Yeah. and then the empties are also on that side yeah, the empties are also back there as well okay uh, with the empties i think they show you where to go uh-huh i'm not sure where you guys get your empties from but i right. just know where to direct you okay all right thank you yeah yeah Yes, sir. Yeah, y'all didn't know this was a ride along, ride along, did you? Yes, sir. I'm gonna let y'all go right here. But you already know, I see you at the delivery when we drop this off, y'all. I see you in a little bit down the road. That's what this is, damn it. We're riding along, riding along out here, bro. Y'all learning everything. <laughs> You're gonna learn, damn it, boy. Whirlpool, that, that's what they call the company Whirlpool. Y'all know what it is, man. Y'all know what Whirlpool is. I, I think they make like a, I know there's a Whirlpool, uh, uh, not dish, well yeah, they probably got a dishwasher, but I definitely know they got a laundry machine going on. So I think she said from 28 to 52 or something like that. So let's, 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 let's do it, man. See? 
this little ass freaking these short trucks, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So 28 or 52. But yeah, Whirlpool make out some laundry machine, wash clothes. And I know they got dishwashers, but that, yeah, it's stuff like that. Twenty-eight or fifty-two. Here we go. YouTube man, y'all been good to me. <laughs> y'all been good now. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. Y'all been good now. You know what I'm saying? Y'all have been good, man. Y'all once again roll with a kid, y'all. Y'all once again roll with a kid. Almost the whole trip. What? <laughs> okay. I see you. I see you, family. Man, let's go ahead and back this thing in there, y'all. We're gonna go ahead and back this thing in there, there man. Let's go ahead and back this thing in there, y'all. I think I may have to go into the office or something and um, to get my, my empty. That's what I'm guessing. Cause she said something about, they would tell me. I didn't bother asking who is they. So, but it's cool. What am I doing, man? I got to pick one of them. I can't be in between two. So I'm just gonna assume that they would be the folks in the office. And then I saw the, I saw the sign for the wheel car sign. So, you know, at least I know where they, that's at. And that's where we're about to go. So we're about to drop this to the hole, y'all. Yeah, I am about to tell you how bad this is right now. This is bad, y'all. Like this is... Huh? She said anywhere from 22. Right. Oh, not the door? Ah, so 20, okay, so in the yard. Okay, okay, my bad, sorry, I, I just thought it. I appreciate it, thank you, sir. Look at this, man, I was out here talking about back into a freaking duck. I was supposed to be in the yard, man. So 28 or 54 in the yard. But this is how you know I've been grinding too then. Early, man. Grinding too early, man. Oh, I'm tripping, tripping. 96. Okay, obviously ain't, ain't something ain't right out here, bro. Something ain't right. So Okay, uh, okay, so what it is they remove some numbers. It looks like other numbers used to be on here, so but they remove them. Okay, okay. Okay. Now I see it. I swear I'm tripping today, man. I swear I'm tripping today. Like, I'm tripping today. Lord, have mercy. Boy. Yeah, I'll see this nonsense I'm doing right now. Which ain't even called for, bro. This ain't, this, this, this ain't even called for, man. What am I doing? Losing focus out here, man. 
I'm out here doing nonsense like I ain't got a place to be. You know what I'm saying? I, I got a place to be, boy. This will drop this right here. Good, I see an old boy right here. I'm about to ask his ass. Cause I need to know if do I just grab an empty trailer and bounce or if I gotta do something else. Hey, my man. So whenever I drop this up, do I just find me an empty and leave or? Go around that way there. Uh-huh. Circle around to your left. Right. On your left-hand side on that next road. Okay, all right, thank you, sir. Appreciate it. All right, all right, all right, boy. All right, all right. Let's go. So. Let's get it. Time is of the essence. Two hours. And this. And we're also talking about Orlando, y'all. So, which means. Don't hurry the hell up. By 8 or 9 o'clock, people going to start going to work. And my ass is about to get stuck in traffic and run out of time in traffic. Trying to get ahead to Jacksonville. So. Scare me, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, if you want to, uh, right here on this on this side of the building, uh -huh. door 50, uh -huh. there's an empty there. Okay. If you want to take that one okay. out. Okay, does it have its coat or a windbreaker in the bottom? Like, like, uh, uh I have, I, I like know what the you're blue stuff? About. Yeah, okay. Does it have to have that or you don't? Well, I like to have it because it allowed me to go everywhere. Like this, like this. Yeah, well, you can't go to California. Yeah, yeah, pretty much, yeah. I, I check it out, though. Check it if, if, if I got you. I got you. Take it, take it. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And then I just pick it and go to the guard, right? Because she already signed my paperwork and everything. All right. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, we there. We're there, we're solid. We're in there like swimwear, boy. So he said number 50. He said 50 got something in there, boy. So let's go check out 50 right now before we waste time looking for something else. Let's go. All right, guys. We made it. 
to wear. You know what? What do I always say? Say with me. I'd rather show you than to tell you, so let's go. <laughs> yeah, look, man. First of all, I want to apologize. Like, okay, so what happened was this morning, man, the camera power died, y'all. It died. So uh, I dropped off the load, okay? So it died, but I was able to drop off the load where it needed to be. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I don't know what is going on right now, but we drop out the low way it needed to be. And um which was Orlando. I dropped that off. They headed back, came in, we're pulling here with like an hour to spare. And I was I knocked out. As y'all can see the bear, y'all. I literally came, I knocked out, bro. I fell asleep heavy. Fell asleep heavy. I woke up at like four or five o'clock. With like eight missed calls from everybody. I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. I was asleep. But anyways, let me tell you what I'm, what we're about to do is. I'm going to put you all on game, right? I'm putting you all on game. Y'all realize it's December, right? Tax season is coming up. So, I, I told you all, man. I told you all, I don't sleep for 10 hours no more. I do a lot of reading. So, one of the things I've come to learn... The government actually give us a hotel allowance. See, that's one thing some of y'all don't know. And this is free game. We get a hotel allowance. So, obviously, all of us don't be out here sleeping in hotels every day because you're trying to keep some money in your pocket. But look, if you want some of that right off, y'all, you got to sleep in a hotel a few times. I've slept in a hotel once this year. Guess what I'm doing? Since I'm doing the reset, my black ass just booked me a two-night at the freaking Super 8 down the street. So that is where we're gonna spend the night. I'm literally just here to get my backpack. Bam. Then I'm gonna go shower, get myself fresh, watch freaking TV all day, chill all day Saturday, uh, Thursday, and bounce on Friday. That's it. That's it, bro. That, that's literally it, y'all. All that for some reason was like hundred and eleven dollars. I think that guy just did something wrong, but I don't care. I'ma stay there. That's what I'ma do. I'ma stay there regardless. But yeah, that's literally it, y'all. That is literally it. With me sleeping in the hotel twice, I can at risk write off, you know, four or five hundred dollars or whatever it was. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> A little bit of that tax credit. Uh, uh, creativity if you know what I'm saying but anyways just a heads up y'all learn the game government give us a ride off for hotels every freaking night so if you want to stay in a hotel every night as an owner operator you can do that if you can afford it by the end of the year it's a ride off we just don't do it you know what I'm saying now handle your business how you want to handle your business that ain't my business I'm just giving you a heads up so anyways we are about, I'm about to head out to this hotel. I already paid for it. It's walking right down the street from the Loves in um, Daytona. I'm actually in D Daytona right now. So you know what that means, right? <laughs> Bye. That's the end of this video, YouTube. Thanks for the ride along with me and Janice 6 YouTube. You know what the deal is. The baddest man in the land. Oh, mama. There goes that man, YouTube. My views are real. My views are raw. My views are authentic. Uh, uh, uh. You can't talk trucking without putting Chasing Mr. Hamilton in a YouTube. I'm out.